Hello and welcome to my channel. Thank you for clicking on this video. If you have thought about signing up for share a sale for affiliate marketing and you have tried to do that in the past couple of days, then you know that is no longer an option. Since March 2025, all new share a sale accounts are being exclusively launched to Awin. So might as well just go ahead and make yourself an Awin account. And that's what I'm here for. I'm here to provide you with a very simple and basic tutorial. So let's get started. Remember that I do timestamp chapters so that if you're not interested in one particular part of the tutorial, you can always jump around. For those of you who are new to affiliate marketing, this website here, Awin, very similar to Amazon affiliates or to share a sale, this is a network that connects brands to publishers or affiliate marketers. And what I am doing here is I am just scrolling down so that you get a glimpse of the different information that is provided on this website to give you an idea of the different ways in which you can be a partner, a publisher, and an affiliate marketer. I am someone who encourages everyone to really dive in to these different avenues of making money online and make sure that you watch videos, that you read different testimonies um, of how you're making this money and to see if it will be a good fit for you and if you think that it's something feasible for you. I know that we're all chasing the dollar, we're all chasing the paper, we want to get more money. I understand, trust me, but you also need to make sure that this is something that you will actually be comfortable doing and that you think is realistic for you. So don't just depend on this video of mine here, although I am happy that you're here. Let's go ahead and get ourselves signed up. So this information is very straightforward. I'm going to go ahead and enter it and then I'm going to jump to the next screen, which is the promotional type. Some of these selections here, especially as a beginner, it can seem a little bit overwhelming, but do not get overwhelmed. There is nothing that you can't go back and fix later if you realize that you checked a box that you didn't really want to check and no one is expecting you to be an expert in the very beginning. This is just about getting your profile built so that Awin can do a verification check on you and see if what you have indicated here is realistic. All of that is just to say, don't go clicking every single box that you see here. Read the descriptions and think about what it is that you are going to be doing, what platforms you are going to be using, and how you are going to get traffic driven to these affiliate links so that they check out these brands, that they make purchases, and then in turn, you make a commission. I won't personally be using email, but as I said in the beginning, I like to try and show everything that I can in these tutorials so that you all can get the best impression of the platform that I am showing you and you can make the best informed decision for yourself. So hopefully by just watching this and reading over this information, you're able to decide instead of going on and um, creating your own account and going through this process and spending so much of your own time. So for the URL, I am using an Instagram account that I used to have for an e-commerce business that I was running for a little while over the summer. When choosing a sector here, clearly what you're going to want to indicate is what sector you promote in your content creation or your influencing or what you are hoping to start promoting. If you're planning to create a whole new social media profile for the sake of affiliate marketing, just remember, as you can see by this page right here, they take their verification very seriously to make sure that you are legitimate. I am going to go ahead and complete this information. And just so you know, they do charge you $1. The $1 payment is refundable after you make your first commission, but they do have the policy to charge to your bank account for verification purposes. What is nice about this, although it was a bit of a hassle for me to be honest, but I do appreciate that they take this seriously and they also have a vetting process with their brands too, not just you as the publisher or the affiliate marketer. So we all live happier doing our marketing, happier with more trust. It's all good. Anyways, 
This is the dashboard and how it will appear once you have created an account and registered. But remember, it does take up to two or three business days for verification to be completed. So I will see you when I'm verified. All right, I'm in the game. I am verified. It took two days for me to become approved. And as you can see, it's a new dashboard. There is my $1 charge that they use to verify my bank account. The right hand panel has tracking information. And then of course you have tracking information right here in the middle too, comparing from previous months, which I don't have anything to compare because I am new. And then if you scroll down here, this is where you can find information on new advertisers and you can get a lot of information here. And remember that they have also went through a vetting process as well. The action items included here are my creative commission rates and then view profile and also join program. Let's go ahead and view commission rates because that is probably the first thing that most of you will want to know about. This supplement company offers a commission rate of 20%, which is pretty substantial. A lot of retailers, especially, they offer 5 to 10% in commission rates. 20%, I would say, is pretty solid. Now for the same brand, I'm going to look at their profile here. This, of course, is where you get your first impression of the company. This is where you determine if this would be a good fit for your own personal brand and what you're all about and then of course with the company themselves so this is a great way for you to go through and figure all of that out for yourself and then pay attention to the left hand side there it also gives you some important information on payments and then you know i know that's why you're wanting to do this right like we talked about in the beginning chasing the dollar chasing the paper and then there's also account contact as well if you have any additional questions or perhaps even concerns about partnering with them. They have somebody for you to reach out to. For some publishers or affiliate marketers, it may also be important for you to know the longevity of this company, how long they have been around, if they are brand new, or if they have been around for a while. So all of this, of course, depends on you and your values and what is important to you when you are thinking about partnering with someone to market their brand for them and their product. Another important tab for you to look at and pay attention to are the terms of the company. This is where they lay down the law, right? This is where they lay down all of their rules, their expectations, what they will permit and what they will not permit. And this, of course, is important to make sure that it aligns with what you are willing to do as far as your promotional strategies and um, what you're not willing to do as well and just making sure that that all lines up well. The next tab over is performance and the index performance is a metrics used by Awin to assess and track the performance of affiliates, advertisers, and campaigns. This will provide insights into how well campaigns are performing based on um, performance indicators like conversion rate, commission earned, revenue, traffic performance, engagement, and click-through rate, key factors such as that. And then here on commission, again, this is just showing you that they offer a 20% commission rate on all sales. After reviewing everything that is important to you, you can click the add sign to join the program. This is the window that will pop up. Remember that they will also look at your information and your social media profile to decide if it is a good fit for them as much as it is for you. I know that most of us have a habit of just scrolling to the bottom and signing our life away, but do make sure that you are in agreement with their terms and conditions and that you are okay with their policies. All right, and speaking of profiles, I'm sure you've noticed this little window up here that says that I have not completed my profile. So essentially what you just saw from the supplement company and from other advertisers, you want to make a profile as well because you want to make yourself trustworthy to these brands who might consider letting you market for them and promote for them. Let's check out some other important tools. So I'm gonna show you the partner recommendations. 
This is based off of your profile. So again, you'll want to make sure that that gets completed so that their system can recommend and match you more appropriately. The next tool that I'm going to be showing you is my creatives. And this is also an action item that you saw when we were looking over the new advertisers on the platform. The My Creatives tab is a section where you can access various marketing materials provided by the brands or advertisers you're partnered with. I am not partnered with anybody, so you're not going to see any specific brands here other than just these generic ones from the Alwyn platform. Moving on, I'm going to take you to the Link Builder tab. In this platform, this is a tool that allows affiliates and advertisers alike to create custom tracking links for their campaigns. So these links are used to track clicks, conversions, and other key performance metrics uh, for affiliate marketing efforts. All under this tab, you're able to create custom links to generate affiliate um, links for specific products, landing pages, or offers. Tracking parameters are also available under this tab, deep linking, promo codes, and offers. In essence, the link builder tab here is essential for affiliates um, or publishers also that they are called to create and manage tracking links that help them monitor their performance and overall optimize their campaigns. What I'm going to be showing you here was a little confusing to me in the beginning, but what a click ref button is related to tracking affiliate performance. So this refers to the click reference, which is a custom tracking parameter that um, affiliates can use to track specific clicks and campaigns more effectively. It allows affiliates to add unique identifiers to their tracking links, helps in tracking specific promotions, ads, or campaigns to see which ones perform best. And then of course, just briefly showing you your deep link options that you have here. They do all work. I tried them out myself, um, including the QR code. So all of these are very useful into your promotional methods. All right, my friends, that is going to include this very basic tutorial. I hope that you got some useful information from here and that it helped you decide if you would like to use Awin as your affiliate marketing platform. Be sure to like and subscribe. Thank you all so much. Until the next time.